Hello everyone, Barna here, and welcome back to a fifth episode of Undertale Yellow. Last episode, we got done with the, the fun country part. We're not a cowboy anymore, but we're still the best darn deputy that ever lived. And now we're helping our girly over here, Soroba, uh, look for her daughter in this giant lab that we're getting hunted down by a killer robot. And this is where we left off in this little break room. And let's try to see if we can get out of here. So let's not waste any time and let's get on with the game already. All right, so I'm fully expecting a boss fight or something. Oh, <gasps> you GPS. Watch it, Clover. We don't want to alert any outsiders, especially workers under Asgore like the UGPS. Your mail will have to wait. But, uh, Sarobra, my mail. I want to see the whale mail. The wet mail, whale, whale mail. <gasps> Wowie. Howdy. Boy, am I glad that fox lady let you roam free for a bit. Not being able to talk to my pal has been torture. Now, I know she roped the end of some lab detour, but... Come on, captive monsters? Talk about a conspiracy nut. I mean, it's like you don't want to follow my advice. Remember your real mission, Clover. The five children you set out to find in the first place. There's no need to visit that dingy lab, you know. As we're still out there threatening human lives. Keep your head in the game. This is our journey, not Sorobra's. Our, but uh, she's cool though. Hey, wait up. Hi. I think I'm ready to get back into things. Lead the way. Hey, we got our girly, come on. All right, let's get the hell out of oh. You gonna defend me? Go Gusik has come to share some sounds. He sounds pretty, pretty cool. Let's vibe with him. You try to enjoy the music, but can't keep up. If you can't vibe it up, give it up. up. Oh! oh, that was the robot. Okay. Uh, oh, wow. That's weird. Oh, it's like stopping the sound from one part of my headphones and just putting on the other. That's weird. Your eardrums do not appreciate the current situation. Yeah, that was awful, dog. Can I, like, retune him? You move Gusik's needle to a new, calmer record. Hey, what, 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 what is this? Uh, oh, that's, this is easy. Easy peasy baby move. Easy. You're still not satisfied? Now can we vibe with the new music? You close your eyes and tap your foot to the music. Gusik joins you. This is n nice. Ooh. Oh, that's a cool attack. Barely even have to move, but... And Mercy? Yeah! Alright, get out of here, Gusik. Um... Can't go that way. Woo! Oh. More steam. Fantastic. One more time, Clover. You got this. Oh yeah, you, you know how I handle this. You know how I handle the steam. I'm running. I'm running without a care in the world. See? Oh, I'm just crazy. Ooh. 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 Nope, I don't mind. I don't mind it. Not one bit. This steam, nothing. Shout out to This steam will not stop me. See, I'm a genius. Come on, Soroba. Get over here. Hell yeah. Come on, girly. Oh, oh, we're getting to like the main, the main thing of things after we get done with this guy. Oh, oh, this is all, all weird plantified. Holy, what happened here? Hope this stuff is okay to touch. I don't know. Um, a dried up fountain lies before you. It doesn't look remotely operational anymore. Yeah. Various types of plants sit within several containers. The smell is unnatural. Uh, yeah, these are kind of gross. You peer into the box and find a bucket of nails. Take them? Sure. You got nails. Awesome. I have nails now. Uh, Soroba, this stuff's weird. To a science division. Employees have reported the generator is showing more wear than ever. The engineers predict the machine won't last longer than one year from now. I need you to speed up the testing of alternate power sources. The underground depends on it. Head office. Oh, hello, robot. Hi. A grown-over robot. You can almost make out a face on its screen. Oh man. 
Poor robot. To head office. More tests are underway, both biological and mechanical. We don't know which direction will ultimately be best for Monster Kind yet. However, the chemistry lab did have a breakthrough regarding a white plant. I'll let you get back to it on that once further testing has commenced. Science division. Yeah, uh, so about this white plant, uh, I think it worked. To head office. I think we've got it. The white plants have proven able to generate electricity at a fantastic rate. The only issues is that they grow four times faster than normal flora. And once their power is drained, they will wilt into a dark, sticky substance. If this is greenlit, we will need a new division to tend to these plants. Otherwise, working conditions will suffer greatly. Science division. Yeah, I think the the working conditions have, have suffered a lot right now. Two science division. The plant should suffice as a temporary solution. I've heard one, or, one of our top scientists is working toward a new compound. One made from special energy. It could be the key we need. Much more time is necessary to develop it properly. However, as for the proposed greenhouse division, I have an idea. Cheaper, more efficient, and trustworthy. I'll send you some blueprints shortly. Thank you for your time and research. Head office. Okay, so they wanted better power. So the, they got they grew these plants and the plants took over the base. So I'm going to assume this thing's going to jump up and beat my ass. Oh? Oh, I stepped on it. It's probably a bad thing. I'm sorry, plant. Don't mind me. Step up. Soroba? What was that? I... Oh. Oh. Am. Awake. That is a big robot. That's a big boy. Gardener model 02. Status. D damaged. Oh. Hello there. Was it you who disturbed the floor? Uh. I ask you to please have more respect. Um, we apologize. Uh, won't happen again. Do not worry. Seeing that the child is so y young, it is forgivable. I will report the incident as a level 3034 LLEE. -E. Level 10 offense. Level 10 means the termination of that trampler. <gasps> yeah, I did kind of step on some plants, I'm not gonna lie. Hold on. Farewell. Oh, I'm fighting a big robot now. Ah, I'm stuck, Clover. We need to find a way out of this fast. White spores roll through the air. Okay, so I can. Still oh, I have to chip away at the task at the bottom. That's goofy. I've incapacitated your options. I ask you cooperate with me. Oh wow. All right, chop those off. Accept your offense, Trampler. Right, not too bad, not too bad. Oh, I can almost act. You must learn that plant life is important. More important than you. Uh, but I'm pretty important. Oh my golly. Well, I'm gonna need to chip away at items. Check. Gardener attacks 12, defense 12. Traps offenders for easy comprehension. Uh, apprehension, my bad. If you do not yield, I will call for backup. But, like, what if he didn't call for backup, right? Like, wouldn't that be crazy? Whoo! Alright, let me chip away at items. You are a handful. I'm going to count to three. Ooh, wow. Bro. I have to do this next attack. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> I was gonna be like, I have to do this next attack without getting hit, but uh, I died. Who knew a robot could be so cold blooded or just cold? Unless things get even weirder, you never know. He's got dodge a weird laser. Oh, it spins the opposite way. That's what threw me off last time. Got it. Honeydew coffee. Drink that shit up. Yeah. One. <laughs> Oh, wow! Jeez, that move is- ah! Oh, okay, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. Alright, we have Axe Free now. Two. Not bluffing. Oh, wow. 
Jeez. All right, that's a little spooky. Mm, I'm gonna just drink coffee. I don't trust that. Three. Calling back up. Oh, what are these guys doing? You called for help, gardener? Correct. This trampler does not value the greenhouse. What is the offense level, miss? 10, termination. Level 10? I mean, of course. We are sorry, offender. Gardener says you deserve termination. They know. I just said that. <laughs> so, attack, uh, right. This is only getting worse. Don't stop your efforts to free us. All right, so I got Whoa! Wow, the cheese that comes out so fast. Alrighty. I got the hang of that move. Can I act the guard? No, I can't act the little dudes. Keep it up. What are you gonna do now? Oh, you're just throwing stuff at me. Don't throw bricks at me. Ow. All right, uh, beef jerky, I guess. Scarf down the beef jerky. Your HP is maxed out. Please stay in your confines. Oh, am I supposed to be freeing all of my effects? Oh, I didn't know that. Ow. I'll do mercy next. Please stay in your confines. Ow. Jeez. I didn't know I was supposed to be cutting all these. Yes, yeah, it's just a repeating dialogue now. And chop through. Dude, this move sucks! <laughs> Damn it! Oh man, alright. There we go, we're free now. Oh! Way to go! I'll do what I can to help us escape for good. Cleverly done. You have gained my respect, but you have not gained my mercy. But, attack! Oh. Oh, Soroba! Thank you so much! Oh, wow! Wait, what? Oh, jeez. Oh, wow. No! What is that? Oh, that was goofy. I now know what's going on here. Ow, fuck. Doesn't make it any easier. Oh, adequate job. Thank you for your help. No problem, gardener. Yeah, give us a call anytime. Even just to hang out or something. Oh. Uh. Or not. It's no bad. No, <laughs> no big deal. Offense level. Oh. So this is where the actual fight starts. Just you and I again. It's too bad I cannot grow tired. For you, that is. Oh, wow. Oh, I'm fine. Alright, um. A bleed? You plead with Gardener, and it seems to have an effect. Offense level lowered. Hey, I'm here for the attack. Oh, you missed it. Seriously, man. Hey, it is okay. Here, a flower to cheer you up. Yo, thanks. Mind if I attack a little? By all means. Oh, he's got a gun. He's got a gun. He's got a gun. Help! Help! He's shooting me. <laughs> Please stop. Stop. Stop the toddler. He's kind of plicky. Oh, okay. Uh, Queen? Still standing. You're rather upsetting. Oh, not these guys. Whoa! Someone grenades at me now. Right, we're almost there. Just wait until my creator hears about this. You will get a long lecture. A lecture more painful than anything I am doing. True torture. Oh, jeez, that, like, st stuttered for a minute. It scared me. I thought it was gonna go the opposite way for a second. Come on. After that, the head office will give you an award. Excellence in ruining Gardner's day. Deserves. The gears are, like, at the... Oh, there we go. At the bottom, it wasn't giving him enough time to run around. Oh, come on, we're almost done. Wait. You, you, uh, I... Oh, offense level lowered. <gasps> oh, what happened? 
There seems to be a gap in my memory core. I am sorry. Oh, <gasps> please. I think that did the trick. You're pretty clever in intense situations. I'm impressed. <gasps> oh. Yes! Get out of here! 50 gold, I'll take that. Uh, I was about to do something. Oh, yes, I remember. Sending level three report. Response, negative. I apologize. Allow me to call again. Sending level three report. Hello, creator. Are you there? I believe my creator may be playing a practical joke on me. Signaling Steamworks head office. Beep, the line you are contacting has been disconnected. Where, where is everybody? Oh, I have allowed immense overgrowth. I understand. It seems my day has passed. Cancel report and reinitate hibernation. Hibernation sequence engaged. I am sorry for inconveniencing you. I do not know what the world is like now, nor d do I wish to. Alright, bye buddy. Life was m much better, not knowing. Oh, that's pleasant. Let's keep moving I'm not gonna step on the flower right right <gasps> flowey hi where am I at now do I know where I am have I been here oh fighting a what televis tunes in that thing looks terrifying uh watch while this is your favorite channel televis don't look amused what are you staring at? Nothing worth it, that's for sure. Oh, they're like two people inside of each other. All right. Not bad, not bad. Ow. Uh, wait, no, I didn't mean to watch it. Damn it. Bro, the music is going insane. Signal? You help Telly fig- you helped Telly finagle her antennas to find some program. Oh, whoa, hey, I'm picking something up. What? It never goes in the corner, right? It never goes in the corner. It could never hit in the corner. And I'm better. Uh, watch. Uh, Telly finds a show she thinks you'll love. Hard disagree. Here comes the best part. Oh, yeah. This is a great show. Seen it. Ow. I hate reruns. Don't reboot anything nowadays. Give me something new. But it's cool. Leave me alone, please. It's <laughs> robot, we gotta go. Oh. Oh, big, big door. Two paths. Hold on. Oh. Can't go in here. That symbol, I've seen it on Chujin's work uniform. Let me try one of his codes. Alright, go find your husband, dog. Nope. Uh, well, I only have one left, but I already used it. Here goes. Oh, yeah! Let's go! Hell yeah. Seriously? Same code as the Dunes Gate? With this kind of security, no wonder Axe is so vigilant. After you. All right, oh, hell yeah. Oh, this is spooky. Oh, safe. Oh, hey. Uh, hello. Um, yeah, I think he's dead, dog. Rusted through. The sign says if the receptionist is unreceptive, check with the robot control station three floors up. Robot control station? Clover, are you thinking what I'm thinking? You access, yes. Exactly. If there's some sort of breaker box for all the robots in this area, we can shut access down and get to Hotland as planned. It's worth an investigation, at least. Let's go. Alright, hell yeah, we shut down all the robots. I like that. This sounds like a great idea. Fantastic, even. Oh. Please don't have access running around here. I don't want to deal with them. Uh. Oh. 
What is this? Hi. Good morning, Steamworks employees. Hope you're ready for another day of productivity. Today we are boxing and shipping goods out into the underground. That sounds awesome. Let's go. Uh, hello? Are you sentient or a pre-recording? Hello, new hire. Yes, I am fully sentient. Trapped in this two-dimensional rectangle for all eternity. R right. Can you unlock all the doors in the factory? We're in a hurry. Sorry, but each morning we do a little thing called EARN YOUR FREEDOM! Complete a full shipment and you'll be on your way! What kind of policy is that? When there's a quota to meet, ethics go out the window! Haven't you worked a job before? Of course, but I don't work here. So you're trespassing! In that case, uh, fine, we'll do the job. Clover, this bot might have connections to access. Seems we gotta do what it says to avoid unwanted attention. You can work this thing, right? Push the start button and we'll get it over with. Oh? So what do I do? Oh. What are you doing? Put red items in red boxes and blue in blue boxes. Three strikes and you're out. Your machine's broken. The second conveyor belt doesn't move. Oh, uh, no. Y yeah. It's bro- no. Uh, screw this. Clover, you box the goods and I'll toss them into the chute. Teamwork, right? Something like that. Let's give it a shot. Oh shoot, wait, how do I work this thing? Oh, oh okay. Oh, easy. Boom. Uh, wait, oh no, I probably wasn't supposed to do that. Oh, jeez. What? Damn it! Better try again. Oh, did I do it? Oh, thank the lord. Oh, the weird plant stuff is all over here. Hey, alright, good work, Clover. Onto whatever awaits us next. All right, come on, Robo. Let's go up here. Wherever here is. Another one. Uh, 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 fun! Hello again. The shipment is almost complete. One final step, and you may have the passcode to exit. All you have to do is uh, sort each colored package by titling the pl tilting platform left or right. Pretty obvious. Look who paid attention learning colors in preschool. Not by choice. I'll take the drop shoot up top. You man the platform. Good, good. All right, bye. Ready? Here goes nothing. Okay, so this scene should be pretty easy. Oh. Alright, this one will be so much easier. Blue. Blue. Red. Red. Boom. Do a little jump like, yeah. And... Ooh. Oh, you go that way. Oh, shoot, this is where it gets awkward. Where it gets awkward. Oh, no. This is where it gets awkward. Oh. Oh, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Hell yeah. Huh. <sighs> Coming back down. Great job, everyone. You can't spell Steamworks without teamwork. Can't spell without steak either, but that has absolutely no bearing on this situation. Let's see how you did. Calculating. Aw, you barely scrapped by, but that's what performance reports are for. Hey, at least I passed, right? Hey, it isn't our fault this system is so impractical. Why does it take two giant steps to ship a few packages? Why can't we sort the colors when boxing them in the first room? Oh. Uh, beats me! You know, for being built by such great minds, the Steamworks are awfully convoluted. It takes a massive IQ to understand the complexities of the Steamworks. Your brain probably isn't advanced enough. Says the wall-mounted GIF com compromise of three pixels. You know what? You can take your little passcode and- Oh. <laughs> Clover's like, dog, calm down. 
<laughs> It'll be all right. Uh, just, just give us the code. Of, of course. The passcode is one six seven one. Got it? One six seven one. Yeah. Thanks. No, thank you, employee. Thank you for making the underground a little brighter. All right. One six seven one. I don't know if I'm supposed to remember that, but I will. All right. Oh, it's right here. Boom. 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 Hey, and I'm out of here. Ooh. Hi. Metalworks emergency escape plan for Meep. For Meep, my bad. In case someone sets the room on fire, do not use the elevator. Evacuate down to the floor one or use a passcode to access floor three. Uh huh. They really locked this into place up tight. Well, if the code was found nearby on the first floor, let's take a look around. All right. Oh, this is a big room. Oh, come on. There you are. Uh, no way. You seriously want to do this again? Yes. Remember the explosion that incapacitated you? Yes. I retrieved brand new hands. I am unstoppable now. Look, at some point you gotta shush. Do not resist arrest any longer. Stand still and let my handsome hands shine. Oh. <laughs> Shoot. Uh, Clover, th this way. No, his hands. My uh, vision initiated 16 volt super flashlight. 95% of power utilized. Typography box hindered. What do you mean? Oh, this is most un. This is bad. Oh well. Unlike them, I have eyes. But the, but we we have eyes too. So we have to hide from him now. Okay. We need to stay out of his view and keep quiet. There's gotta- Hello again! Whatever are you two doing? <laughs> so I'm gonna calm down. <laughs> oh, she's not having it. Girl, are you okay? As I was saying, there's gotta be a code around here. Once you find it, head for the exit. Alright. Just gotta hide from the robot. Oh, shoot. Hello, robot. Don't mind me. A large collection of familiar stones. Unfortunately, nothing in the file catches your eye. Oh, no, no, no. no. Okay. Um, 60 gold sits abandoned in the machine. Take it? Oh, yes, of course. Maybe these, like... Oh, B3. A3. So three, 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 two, one. Got it. Oh, you figured out a code? Hurry and give it a try. Three, three, two, one, right? Hey, I'm a genius. Uh oh. Okay, let's head upstairs before I. Hello, Axis. Just the bot I was looking for. How are you doing these days? Not so good. I can only speak in 15 characters max. Back there. I kind of bum- it kind of bummed me out. I'm sorry to hear that. Glad you got your full speech ability back. Thank you. I do not like talking. Wait. Wait! Are they trying to distract me from my mission? No. Oh, okay. Can I ask you a question involving the security of the Steamworks? Yes, I am a security expert. Why is it that some doors require a passcode to unlock? and others require Steamworks ID? Two-factor authentication. Huh. Uh. Hmm. Oh, yeah, let's get out of here. Cool. <laughs> All right. Yeah, let's, let's, just, let's just get out of here. I don't want to be with the robot anymore. Workstations. Okay, well, probably another code to find. You know the drill. All right, let me save real quick. An old PC sitting on two desktops. The image on the screen gives you a nostalgic feeling. That's amazing, but I need to save. While I was taking notes, you are all struck by the absolute pipe pandemonium of display. How do they do it? Oh, that is a lot of pipes. Someone got mad over here. Many sticky notes are posted around the smashed in PC. 
We've replaced your computer six times now. Please control your temper. It's just solitaire. <laughs> Bro is getting mad at solitaire. The note on the powered off PC reads, the future is bright. Hang in there. Aw, so wholesome. And that's a hole in the floor. Downsizing imminent. But definitely not for the employee who's reading this. You're doing a great job. Aw. Oh. Aw. Oh. Is this like Chujin's office or something? Must be the manager's office. Surely they had access to all the passcodes. Let's check the file cabinets. Okay, so it's not Chujin's office. Hmm. Hold on. Look here. Performance reports for all factory employees. A, B, O. Oh. Um, you good? 01620XX. Mr. Chujin pitched his blueprints for a guard bot of sorts. He called the project Axis. Uh oh. 031920XX. Axis model 01 has, was presented to King Asgore but was swiftly rejected. The poor thing couldn't stand powered up for more than six seconds. 051020XX. Axis model 04 backfired and shot one of its gloves at the king. This is getting embarrassing. 072320XX. Axis model 07 refused to enter the throne room. Asgore gave Chujin one more shot after incessant pleading. I know he's a smart engineer, but if the next showcase goes south, uh, is he gonna like die or something? 092320XX. Well, this is it. Model 08 booted up and seemed to be stable for a moment. That was until a malfunction occurred and sparks began to emit from the body. In the chaos, one spark leaped onto King Asgore's flower bed. Oh, a fire ignited but was swiftly put out. Okay, well, at least they were put out. I can't imagine Asgore being, like, happy about that. Please leave. Leave and do not return. I, I apologize deeply. But as we are, us monsters simply aren't ready to bypass the barrier. You know this deep down, I know you do. Access is the solution you need. The solution I need is a re reliable one. One that won't set fire to our homes. If this is about my, it isn't. I thank you for your service to society. But I'm afraid monster kind's freedom belongs in more capable hands. Oh. Oh. Huh. Oh man, she did not like that. Capable hands, he says. Look at Axis now, the true realization of Chujin's vision. He far exceeds any model as we're ever saw. And you know who those capable hands now belong to? The scientist who has Kana Kaneko. My bad. Dr. Alphys. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's interesting. Hmm. A while back, she built a robot too. One so lifelike, it got her the position she has now. It must have been real impressive. So impressive that Asgore kicked the other visionaires to the curb. I understand now why Chujin never shared this with me. He must have been absolutely gutted hearing those words. Uh, screw the royals. The politics, all the red tape. This clover. Uh, this is why the mission is so important. You can't trust these closed-minded gatekeepers to do anything right. Not for a second. Uh... Let's go. Okay, so, um... Soroba, I'm hoping your daughter isn't, like, a goo monster in Alphys' lab. I'm really hoping. Richter B. Oni, Engineering Certificate. Uh, and then... Today's elevator passcode, 8487. 8487, got it, got it, got it, got it. Eight, four, eight, seven. Point. Ooh. Oh, not this guy. Hello! I welcome you into my body! Wherever would you like to go? Ah, top floor. Did you say basement? Get us to the roof. Out of here. Whatever. Um, I carry a negative opinion on you. Heading to out of here. Um... That sounds like a horrible idea. Uh, sorry for all the outbursts. All of this is... It's a lot to process. Bet you're pretty tired of learning about me, so... What about you? 
You're not exactly a talker, so I don't know much. Why are you here in the first place? Did you simply trip and fall into the underground? I'm curious. Uh, the five humans. Yeah, there we go. I see. You wanted to find out what happened to those kids. A noble mission takes guts. I'm assuming you haven't found them yet, though. Yeah, dog, I don't think I'm gonna be finding them. We have arrived at out of here! Hey, that's great. Well, uh, better get moving. <laughs> All right, we're out of here. Now where, that doesn't look safe. Oh man. Oh, uh, dude, I don't wanna fight these guys, please. I will never take out the trash, you can't make me. Dude, I hate the, the slippery one. It's so annoying. Like, this one that might actually kill me. Uh, this robot is so annoying. Oh, thank you so much. I'm just gonna go up here. No, no, no. And I can't go up here. Damn it. Watch it, Clover. We don't want to alert any outsiders. Especially under blah, 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 blah. She doesn't want me to have mail. Fine. Ooh. Oh, no. Oh, I thought I was getting attacked. Oh, whoa. I'm guessing this is our ticket out of here. We just have to... Uh, why don't you take a stab at it? Technology and I don't exactly mix well. All right, I got this. Breaks fingers, I'm amazing. A daunting array of screens and buttons lie before you. You press one of the buttons. Now what? Robotics control status functional at 78%. Awaiting input. Uh, main directory, pictures, ooh. Loading. Estimated time remaining, nine hours. Yeah, robotics control status functioning at 78. All right, so no pictures. Games? Loading. Feature blocked. No! Custom message. Trying to play video games on the job? Please report to the head office. We have a pink colored gift for you. Robotics control status? Alright, uh. So, info? Steam workstation R system. OS Delta version 1.4 install, blah blah blah. Procedure Ultra McTurbo Core 180, blah blah blah. Installed physics memory 500 megabytes, blah blah. blah. Graphics card error. Robotics control status functioning, blah, blah, blah. Docs. Error information classified. Blah, 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 blah. Settings? Select your option. Uh, emergency shutdown. Yes. Shut down all helper bots within the vicinity. Yes. Attempting to shut down. Error could not complete task. Just kidding. Oh, pff. all right. Thank you. Emergency shutdown complete. Thank you for shutting down robots. I hope that worked. It's unfortunate access had to end up this way. Maybe I should... No. I wish Trujan's projects could thrive, but a line had to be drawn. I can't dwell in the past any longer. Let's go. Alright, let's go. Sorry, Trujan. Oh, this is cool. I feel like I'm about to get, like, beat up. Oh, yeah, definitely. There's a vending machine. You spot some gravity granola inside the machine. Take it? Oh, hell yeah. Anymore? My faint face is burned into the machine screen. Staring out into the dim chasm of rock and steel. Alright. Um, oh! Oh! I thought she died for a second. Holy shit, that scared me. Hey! Who did that? Clover, you can hear me, right? I'm gonna try to blast a hole in this thing. Uh, yeah, I don't think that's working, girl. It's gonna take a lot to break through. And to think we were almost free of this place. Um, just look around for a switch or a keypad. There's always one near doors. You're right. That is... <sighs> well, I already know what I'm gonna have to do. Hi. Hi, Axis. Main power source not found. Initiating emergency backup power. What was that? Did I just hear Axis? Oh, no. You met. No. You tried to shut me down. I have had it with you and your friend thwarting my plans. I am this close to directing all my steam into my rude finger. And yes, I am yelling. My typography box just lacks an exclamation point char character. A shame, but at least I have question marks. Hey, Clover. 
I don't think we can outrun this guy any longer. Please, try to find a peaceful way to outwit him. I'm sorry, but I don't want Jujin's creation to smash to bits. Outwit? Maybe. Outgun? Never. I am ticked off and of non-lethal options. So prepare yourself, I am attacking now. Oh no. Oh, uh, what? Huh? What? My programming is preventing me from attack. It says you are not a current threat or persisting arrest. Or resisting, my bad. Ugh, forget this. Here, I will make you a threat. Oh. Hold this, it suits you. There, now you have a drawn weapon. Booples are wonderful, are they not? Now, time to die. Oh, that is so goofy. Access model 014, ready to attack. Oh, jeez. Uh, scrutinize. You tell Axis he's not great at his job. If he could frown, he would. Ooh, what? What are you doing with that lid? It was not supposed to be useful. That is cheating. Uh, oh, what? Cool? You pull on your shirt repeatedly and hopes to beat the heat. Your effort fails. Oh, oh, so I take damage of- Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Jeez. Okay. So I, I, I get what I'm doing now. Bro, this is tough. Wow. Oh, what was that? What did I say? Zappa is not a word. Why did I say that? Access flipping through the Royal Guard guidebook. Oh, wait, what does it say? In his mind. Alright. Uh, brace. You ready your trusty shield for whatever awaits. Oh, what? Oh, wow. See, this one's fine. I don't mind this one bit. Wink. Death by metal and magic. Hell yeah. Oh! What is that? <laughs> Oh, what? Am I supposed to, like, angle it? Oh, yeah, there we go. Alright. There we go. Bzz uh, I did it again. How? Wait, this is your doing. Of course it is. Do not shock me again, okay? This smells like a unfortunate barbecue. Alright, keep racing. Oh. Alright, not bad, not bad. A little tricky, but I got it. And... Oh, oh, wow. Alright, so this one's... This is caught me off guard, it caught me off guard. This is all it did. Oh my gosh! Oh jeez! Hey, I step the fuck? I am so starting to regret giving you that lid. Can you please drop it? Just kick it into the fiery pit below us. Simple. No, I didn't mean to load nails. Damn it! No! Oh, come on, man. I didn't mean to load nails. I meant to eat a granola. There we go. Bzz, b d b that is enough. Unbeknownst to you, I brought a backup plan. Portable generators. Infinite battery. Good luck. Um, Glover, I'm almost through. Whatever you're doing, it seems to be working. Keep at it until he's out of juice. Uh, um, uh, I can hear you. You do think you are so smart. Ha, I do not run on juice. In fact, I do not run at all. I roll, obviously. Uh, Axis thinks the music is a bit intense for his taste. Uh, um, so I'll just keep racing. Jeez. Oh my gosh, 2 HP, dude. No! Ah, oh, man. I don't have heals for this. 
I can go and I can go and I trust myself. Oh jeez. I why'd I do that? Come on, man. That's great. There was literally nothing I could have done there. Those batteries. Seriously? I am reaching unheard levels of tint. Level 7, at least. Your fault. Uh... Oh! No! <laughs> Come on! It's not too bad, not too bad, not too bad. Alright. Come on. Screw you! Screw you! Screw you! Uh... Uh, come on. Oh, jeez. No! Oh, come on! For some unknown reason. Jeez. I... Dude, I just don't know what to do there. No! Come on! What? You can't dodge that! That's literally impossible to dodge. What? Uh, how are you supposed to do that? I you can't dodge this. Yeah. <laughs> 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 You would not like me at a low battery. I'm warning you not to drain my battery. And there we go. Good job holding your own while I was occupied. Axis seems pretty dazed. One more shot could do him. Let's end this. The air thickens. Oh, okay. Please. Please. Oh. Let's go! Yes! Oh my gosh! Like 30 minutes of constant fighting this dumb robot, it's over. <laughs> it's over. Beep, beep. Shutting off Sterner's emotions to save power. Ah, uh, what did you do to me? I don't feel an utter murderous rage anymore. I do not know what to do with myself. Suppose I will stare at you blankly until you do something. Dog, you do not know how bad I want to click fight right now, dude. You don't know. Wait, what? I guess for you, please no. Plan B. Okay. You asked the robot to present your metallic creation. Oh. Okay. Of course. Hey, Axis. What? How do you feel about second dates? Like a calendar? Oh, yeah, what a hottie. Oh, my God. What is this? This feeling? Uh-oh. Please tell me it's over. <gasps> yes! Soulmate located. Perfection personified. Where has this beauty been all my life? Holy... The shimmer. The complexion. The curve. Okay, that's enough. Clover, let's, uh, let's wrap this up. Oh my gosh, thank the war. That fight was so annoying. This emotion, it feels so nice. I must thank you for opening my eyes. I had no idea such wondrous sights existed. Glad we could finally reach a level of civ civility. Can I keep them? Uh, whoa, slow down. Here. Do you want to know a secret? Yes, I would like to know a secret. They told me that they like you, but we'll only go out if it's casual. Get to know them a little first, you know? Ask them their name or something. Okay. 
All right, good. Give it a shot. Hello, my name is Axis. What is your name? Uh. <laughs> you are so funny. Want to get married? Uh, hey, remember what we talked about? Uh, uh, they said yes. Uh, what? I am honestly just as surprised as you. This rocks. Okay, then I'm happy for you. Uh, well, not to rain on the parade, but Clover and I have to go. Go where? Hotland. Just a business trip. Well, I wish you a pleasant journey then. Oh. Backup battery extremely low. Please recharge. Oh, suppose I should do that. Recharging will restore me back to factory state, but... Added... Hated human and tall lady to authorize list. There, now I will not attempt to apprehension next time we meet. Thank you, Axis. You have a good life. I will try. Alright, you get out of here, robot. No. Oh, one more thing. Hmm. You said your husband was my creator. Would you tell him that I miss him? He was always very kind to me. I... Yeah, I'll tell him. Thank you. Goodbye. Yeah, about that. Let's, let's, let's go, Soroba. We need a fucking... Can I save? I gotta say, that was pretty entertaining. Not for me! That was awful! Glad we could bypass Axis without destroying him. Turns out you're a pretty damn good leader, Clover. I don't know why I doubted. <sighs> right. I, I see the X out of my head. We're close. Can I save? <gasps> oh, thank you. All right, holy moly, that fight took me so long. It took me way longer than I expected. Oh my golly. You see, the problem was, was that the fight wasn't hard. It really wasn't. It was pretty tedious at times. And it was just like a thing where you have to memorize to learn it. No, not hard in the slightest. My only problem was I pretty much had to no hit like that whole boss because I had one granola bar to heal. His attacks dealt like, I think like six damage or something around there. That stuff destroyed me. So I had to barely scrape by that whole boss fight with one heal. And there was no backtracking anywhere. So I was just, I hated that fight. I, it, like, I was, it probably would have been more fun. And took me less time if I had like some more heals. Even just one more health would have been fine. Like one more healing item. Perfect. Beautiful fight. But the fact that I was limited to one, that sucked. I hated that. But I'm not hating the game. I just wish that I could have gotten more heals. But anywho, that was the fifth episode of Undertale Yellow. I'm ending it off here because that boss fight took me way too long. But I hope you guys enjoyed. And leave a like and comment down below. And subscribe if you're new. It would help me out in the channel a lot. And I would appreciate and I will see you guys in the sixth episode of Undertale Yellow.